this is today's look. It was more bluer on the inner corner. Get my lip combo out. So I did use the 35S Sweet Oasis for Morph. Here's our beautiful inside. I started out with this shade, Picture Perfect, which is this one. Then above it, I went into Love Struck, just a nice light pink. And the outer edge is the shade, is it? Oh, Secret Lagoon. The outer edge. And then here's her here. Coastline Cruise. That's what it looks like. Or it faded. And Wonderless. Right there in the inner corner is Champagne on Ice. Alright. Oh, lip combination. Wrong lip pencil. Dragon Beauty Lip Liner in the shade Lip Jab. It's a weird name. And then GBS Palace. Muted. Alright, let's go to Wednesday's look. There's no Monday look. Alright, so this is today's look. Very different than what I've been doing. I use the More Times Pony Constellation palette. Also, how I show you my palettes like this is how I'm going to do my, um, eyeshadow palette collection because it will be easier and you will also be able to hear me so that that will be how you will be seeing my eyeshadow collection when i get to filming it and then post it so yeah so we'll start down here i started off with the color bamboo just on this outer portion and i went above it with the shade lucid dreams which is this nice light blue. I didn't put anything here, like shadow right there. I just here and then here and I left it empty. Cause see Baddie Bean do it all the time and her shimmer looks great. So I'm thinking if I do the shimmer like that and leave it empty, then my shimmer will stay pigmented. Cause the other day, my blue kind of dissipated into the background mat. So I'm trying to eliminate that. And then for the shimmer all over the lid, is the shade light here light here and an inner corner is this big shade nebula so that's what we're used from the constellation palette so now i will show you lip combination which is my normal the dragon beauty lip liner lip job with the lip liner is my normal. The lipstick I just pulled out to use is the ColourPop Star Wars lipstick in the shade Dark Lord. Here's what she looks like. Makes for a pretty good combination. Alright, so that's for this today. Wednesday's look, so I'll see you tomorrow for Thursday's look. Alright, so this is our Thursday's look. I really like it. All right. So I used the ABH Novena Volume 5 palette. Let me get it open. Jeez. Here's the inside. So I used the shade C5, which is the outer corner. And I went in with the shade a4 here it's a nice light brown and then all over our lid is the shade e3 and then e1 is the inner corner it's the eye look today And lips are ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in the shade Avenue. So that is our makeup look today. Also, I don't, 
I don't think I'm doing a makeup look tomorrow, so this is, I think, I think it's three or four looks for this week. I'm not for sure. But let me show you some of my favorites that I've been loving this week. Is the Natasha Nino Diamond and Blush Palette. I have loved mixing these two highlighters together, which is what I've worn on my face all week this week. Ooh, love it. Also, this makes a good blush topper as well. So I've been loving on this palette. And then this has been really good for my under eyes. Love this. Happy Accident, the Sweat and Wild correction stick it's in the shade you're a natural it looks too dark right when i swatch it on my hand but over my foundation and all that this looks perfect don't even see my dark under eyes and i got bags i get under eyes oh they duck so that is some of my loves this week just those two i love them all right thank you for watching and then hope to see you in my next one Bye.